There have been lots of individual words and terms that I've been introduced to and I wanted to reflect on throughout these 24 hours. But perhaps the one that remains with me uh, most, for, first and foremost, is uh, curiosity. Um, it seems to me that that's a really important feature of anything to do with lifelong learning. Um, we've been asking questions about what is the nature of learning, but it seems to me that without curiosity, no learning can take place, whatever, however we define it and whatever it is. And that curiosity can be applied to virtually everything. Um, it can be applied to the foundations of our Christian faith, the creed, the orthodoxy, faith itself. It can be applied to our culture, the things that surround us, uh, the way that we've been brought up, the things that underpin our lives and uh, suppositions. It can be, it can apply to the way in which we run our training courses, that we design our, our programs of training. We need to be asking uh, things that, are, that make us curious and that help our students to ask serious questions uh, rather than feeding them what they should be told and learned, uh, they should be learning. So it seems to me that uh, curiosity is, is one of the key words to come out of this symposium. Um, we've been periodically, rightly pointed to Christ throughout these 24 hours. And I guess for me, the thing that I am most curious about now is the nature of Christ and how that applies to me and my life of faith. <laughs>